This episode is brought to you by our friends at Hover, the easiest way to buy domain names and do more with them. Get 10% off today by visiting hover.com slash butterscotch. CES 2011 bumped into Ian, and this little guy here. Now this is this is Sphero. Yep. Basically, he's uh, what is he like a robotic control ball kind of idea. Yep. So Tell us about uh, Sphero. So this is our, our prototype robotic ball Sphero, and it's a robotic ball controlled from your iOS or Android device. Okay. So what's actually happening in here? We have, I assume, like a gyroscope. Yep, gyroscope accelerometers, and that's to make it easier to drive. Right. So now it's all connecting to our iPad or to our uh, iPhone or to our Android device uh, via Bluetooth. Yes. And then we so basically, um, you have an app that you download, and then you're actually basically remote controlling this little ball. Yep. So we'll have a few apps you can download when you buy the ball. Uh, you can also download more, and we have an open API environment where any developer can build their own apps, and we'll be releasing more apps as well. Okay, cool. So basically, when we start out, we have a little remote control ball. You can kind of drive them around. But then when we get developers in on the action, you said something about a sumo game? Yeah, so you can download different games. Like, we're working on a sumo game where you could have two balls and you try to knock each other out of a ring. Okay. Uh, you can have a racing game or an augmented reality game or a tug-of-war game. Very cool. So I'm going to put this guy down, if you could uh, drive him for us. Sure. Put him down here. I did have a go at driving this guy a little earlier. It, it was uh, maybe it's a little bit of a, an acquired skill. Go ahead. Yep. So what I'm doing now is I'm um, calibrating the ball so that the coordinate system of the ball is the same as of the phone. So when I drag the little joystick away from me, the ball will move away from me. And when well, I pull the joystick over there, a little green one. back at me, the ball will come at me. So it's not like an RC car where it's forward, back, and turn right or turn left. It's heading based. So if I hold the joystick at a certain angle, the ball will continue to move in that direction. This is the basic driving app. And like I said, we have other uh, games as available as well. Very cool. So when are we actually going to see this in stores? Do we know? Um, so this will be available uh, late this year. Late this year. And do we have a price? Under $100. Under 100 bucks. And where are we going for more information on Sphero? Um, you can go to gosphero.com. Very cool. And for everything we discussed here, links and all that good stuff, hit up the show notes on buttersauce.com. Ian, thank you very much. Thank you. This episode is brought to you by our friends at Hover, the easiest way to buy domain names and do more with them. Get 10% off today by visiting hover.com slash butterscotch.